Refrain. Yo. Okay, so guys, it is Corrales. Welcome back to this Let's Build, the second part of this house, and we're gonna finish this house in this episode. Mm hmm, that's right. I'm gonna do some off camera work. Not on the house itself, on the trees outside, because that is so boring. Yes, it is. And previously, we left off around here, right? And I said to you guys that I'm gonna actually record a second episode straight after the first one, but mm -mm, not me. I waited, you know, just to see your comments, reactions, and stuff, and Damn, you're amazing. Love you to bits, guys. Thank you very much for the amazing support. Amazing. And what I'm trying to do here is to place a wall. <laughs> it's not working out that good now, is it? Let me just think, because we can break off this here, right? We could place a glowstone around this little perimeter. Or can we? And then we can put some glass here. Like a little glass wall. And it's not gonna be a big house, you know? And I know a lot of you like thinking like, oh, why don't you do like humongous houses? But as I said, guys, I lose inspiration. So I like, after a few episodes, it's like, oh my God, not this again. And that's how I roll basically. Ooh, I hate stuff like this when materials are like lining up like that. You know what, let's delete this. And um, you know what? There's only one solution to the problem. You know what that is? BAM! A bush. See? Bushes never let you down. Never. You can always trust a bush. Trust a bush. <laughs> well, not George W. Bush maybe, but you know, Minecraft bushes at least, you know. You know what I mean. I didn't like that guy, the George W. thingy way bush. He seems like, <laughs> he seems like a big stupido, man. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know about you guys, but I don't think he was the brightest light bulb of them all. How does this look? That looks pretty sexy, right? So we can aim for the door here. We can, I, you know, see the big window here and the view. That kind of works out, you know? And what I'm thinking here, you know, I like this shape here. So let's try to duplicate it. Duplicate it? Is that a word? Yes, it is. In my <laughs> vocabulary. Let's try to make it on this side as well. I'm just figuring out how should we make it though. First of all, let's see here. Because it's going to be under like an entrance, a backdoor entrance to the house. Because, you know, we need those. Just imagine if the creepers attack in the front, we need a backdoor exit. Can we do something like that? Let me just see. Is that free? Is this lining up in the middle? It is. <laughs> Pretty amazing stuff going on right here, guys. Or maybe should we do an upside down stair here? Here. Oh, we can do it here, right? Yes, we can. Bam. Hmm. How do we end it here? All right, that goes down and around. You know what? Let's do the same here. Just because we can. You know, strange shapes for the win, I would say. I've said it so many times. Like, strange shapes make the house. Oh, we kind of screw that up. There we go. How's that that look? How does that look? That looks pretty fancy. That is a keeper. And if I'm going too fast, guys, I am I am kind of sorry, you know? But I can slow it down, make it slow-mo. But nah. You know, it is time. It is time to close this off. Let me see here. This, we can make a pillar here. The hardest parts of Let's Builds are actually like, when you're recording just, I'm just talking about recording now, it's actually the interiors because usually it's kind of hard because, because it is just this, it's just this, you know, because it's, I'm spinning around all the time and you guys miss, maybe miss stuff. So I'm going to take it slow, mo, block, 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 block. See how boring that is? You know, I can't do that. I can't do that. It's just totally boring. Let me just grab a window penis from here and bam, 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 bam. Now we got a window up here. Although, this should actually be wood here because that fits with that. And those stairs can be coming all the way around here, I guess. Or can they? Yes, they can. Small houses for the win. Like, even myself loves small houses. 
because I'm building them a lot. But no, the thing about small houses is, you know, it's easy to make. It's like, you know, it's like one or two episodes, the house is done, it looks fantastic. You can just, you know, build yourselves without any biggie and it's done. Like bigging big houses, that is the issue, you know? It just takes so much time, you know? Place this here as well. Let's just cover this up and see how this will turn out. I'm gonna use a lot of sandstone and I don't I don't know if this is the best material to use but like <laughs> we are in the desert and I love the deserts. It's kind of easy to build on desert because you know it's so much free space no bushes around no big trees and you can see what you're doing. Here we're gonna bump this up a bit. Place a perimeter about five blocks all around here. And that's gonna give us a little cool shape in the in the ceiling. Trust me, trust me on this, guys. This will be deleted. This will come here. This will be closed off like that. Look at this. Now we can put some windows up here. That is just bananas. Although let's just tweak this a bit. Maybe we should just add like this here. This here. You know, ju just about making strange shapes. It's all about the strange shapes. Hmm. Should we maybe make <laughs> yet again a strange shape like this? Or should we make it like this, delete those and connect that here? That is a strange shape. You gotta admit that. Or do we want the whole thing being wide? Let me just see how that looks. This might look alright. Do we have slab or I mean quartz stairs? We do, right? Oh, that's gonna look even better, guys. That is a keeper. There we go. So bam. And bam. I like this. Look at it from the inside. That looks kinda modern, right? But maybe not that modern, but it looks modern. And I, I think we're pretty much done with the house itself. Let me just cover this up by using... I'm not I'm not sure about this though. This is totally out of the... Out of the blue. Maybe we can just cover it up to so just give it some nice colors from above. Even though we might not see it, but you know, we know it's here. And that means only more work for you building it. On survival. Alright, from distance, guys. It is a keeper. What I'm kind of thinking of is taking this here just to make the same shape as the other side, but I don't know if that is going to be too much. I think it is. You know what? Let's just go without this on this side. It's time to place a door and the house itself is completed. Now we just need to figure out how to solve some of the interior exterior work. Oh, you know what? Let's just get some cobblestone down here. And I'm not really gonna furnish the house, like, as, like I don't know, it's not my strong side and I can suck at it and it's kind of boring to watch, maybe, I don't know. Ooh, lighting glitches, you know what, nothing I can do about it, just gonna keep it. But I'm just gonna give you some ideas on the house, it's not gonna be like totally modern or stuff, but, you know, on the inside, for example. If we just take this, just pretend that this is a survival house. What I would do, I would place a couch, which is totally pointless in survival. But we got a couch at least, right? So give it some cred. Here, can we delete that? We can delete that. Pretty amazing. And I was thinking, can we delete this? Yes, we can delete this. That gives us some extra space on the inside, which is pretty good. So here, in this corner, I would actually place something like this. This is, is kind of like, you know, kind of pointless, but... You know, if you're just playing survival, it kind of looks nice. There's like a little shape. We can place some beds. And this part I kind of hate because I'm going back and forth into the inventory all the time. But just look at this. Little bed. If you have a friend, you have like two beds next to each other. Pretty amazing stuff. We can place a chest up here. Can this open? It can open. Pretty amazing. We can place a little bush. A fake bush. There we go. <laughs> just look at this, you know? Some, some little derp inspiration and I saw comments you know I saw comments from you guys that somebody suggested that this area here would be a perfect place for a dog 
And I mean, if you're playing survival, let's do a little dog bed around this area. Maybe like this. <laughs> I don't know. You know, then the dog needs some bones, so let's just place a little thing here for him. And I mean, he can totally chill in that area. He will be happy. Can we just do this here? Maybe not. Nah, that looks bad. He can totally chill here. Let me just get a dog. They're called wolves, alright? But let's just pretend it's a dog. I just threw him away. I just got him back. Bones. They eat a lot of bones, so let me just grab a stack of those. Alright, so doggy. Yes, here you are, buddy. Oh, there we go. Look at this. Perfect area for them. Let me just get one other one. Oop. <laughs> this is cool. So if you're having dogs, you know, perfect location for that in the house. This is some really derp ideas, I guess, but I kind of, you know, I kind of hate interior design. Oh, no. Torch. Frame. This. Bam. Perfecto. We can place some more on here. Let me just see here. We can place one here, one here. Or should we make it higher up? That's the question. Should we make it up here? How that looks pretty bad, right? Let me just see here. So let's just compare here and here. Where should we take the torch? Since the since the little trim is up there, it kind of looks really strange having that up here. Just like stuff like that drives me mad at some points. You know, let's see here. Can we can we keep that? Or should we just get those higher up ones? That's the same elevation at that over there, so let's just do that. Delete this. Oh no, torch. Doot, doot, doot. So two on this side, we can place one up here and one on this corner. I'm not sure if this is the best location for them, you know, but if you're playing survival, we kind of need that stuff, because it's gonna be dark in the house otherwise, and, you know, it's gonna blow up. Kinda. Okay. Kinda would need that one here as well, but we can just place a torch, maybe some random torch. Now we can place it there. Maybe we can just take this out a bit. Like this, and just place it here. Not the best solution of them all, but it works out. It works out. What if we delete this here and place it like that? And take this and place it like a little there. Bam! Perfect bed design, I like that. So that is a keeper. Trying to figure out what else do we need. Do we need like a little dining area here in front of the fireplace? It is totally pointless. You know, I think we can delete that. I don't think it will burn. If it will burn, I am so sorry if your house burned down and you've been just like, you know, wasting so much time on it. Gathering all the resources and now it's gone. <laughs> this is not my strong side, but it is cool. Furnaces. Crafting table, kind of need that. So let's just place them here. Bam! Now we got a little furnace area and crafting area. We got storage area here. We can place some storage here as well. Oh, that what we could use is some glowstone. Glowstone here and some chests. Let me grab some chests here. There we go, guys. Perfecto mundo. I don't know what you should have here. Maybe some books or something. We could make a carpet. Black and white. Just to keep the modern modern theme going here. Black and white wool. I love the doggies. Yo, buddies. So let's see here. Let's just do something here in the middle. Really strange and awkward shape. Just because we kinda can, right? That kind of looks a bit modern. <laughs> I'm happy with that. We could, you know what we could do? Let me just try this out. Can we maybe make this a bit smaller? Just so we get some more space going. Yo doggies, don't worry guys. That looks pretty amazing. Right? Now they got a little more cozy area up here on this little platform. If you don't want to do it, just don't do it. Although, let's just try this out as well. If we just place this here and replace... Oh, I'm just jumping about. Can make something like that. It's just, you know, just go 
inspiration flowing here. Just in case. I don't know, I suck at this, but this is at least some ideas if you're playing on survival, right? So we get the little thingy thingy area here. You know what we're missing? Anvil. Anvils are useful. I just spotted a location, which would be pretty nice. Bam. A bush here. Just because we can. <laughs> Crazy stuff. I think we're pretty much done. Let me grab one more. Oh, we can't grab that. I guess. So let me just find an item frame. Let's just make one more torch here. And I am happy with the interior. This is just to get some inspiration for you guys. Come on, you can do this. You can place in the frame. There we go. See, guys? We made it. We made it pretty. We got the bed. We got the little crafting area. Storage. Everything's fine. Are we happy? We're happy. Let's continue on the outside. So, on the outside, let's just... I'm not going to do much on the outside, you know, because it's kind of pointless doing too much on the outside because it's a really small house and it's going to be like... I don't know. We can make a pool or something, a little water feature, maybe off camera, just because that is so boring to watch. I don't know. We need those bushes though. Do not neglect those bushes, never. Never neglect those bushes. Let's see, there, 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 there. Der, 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 der. Der, 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 and people actually, like, you know, you guys asked me if I was drunk in a previous episode. No way, Jose. You know, I'm just high on life. <laughs> that, that's what I am. And you guys, oh, he must be drunk because he's talking funny. Uh -uh. Not drunk, just high on life. How does that look? Bad. Place this here. Much better. Oops. So just a little backside entrance. What we can do here is like a pool area. Like just a little jacuzzi pool. I'm not gonna go crazy with a pool, but we could have like a little jacuzzi. You know, everyone is a jacuzzi. Or, I don't know. And maybe quartz. Just because, you know, if you're playing a survival, this will be the hardest material to get. Well, not to be honest, because quartz is like everywhere in the nether. Everywhere. And especially in, like, if you just started building a new map or something, it's everywhere. Just go to the Needle Nether and it's there. Hmm. This will be a really strange jacuzzi shape. It kind of looks like a round circle, but yet again, not. <laughs> we gotta keep it. We got a little pond here, we can extend that and make it really pretty. And you know what I saw in, in the comments? You guys think there was not enough bushes, so we'll just wait and see. I'm gonna add some bushes ar around the house and you'll be totally surprised how many bushes I can add. Well, I'm not gonna go really crazy, but I'm gonna add some. And for, I mean, for the floor here or for the bottom here, you could use like a lava or something with glass and that would look kind of, you know, like a hot tub, if you know what I mean, but Nah, I'm just gonna go with some water. Some basic shape here. Alright, is it flowing everywhere? Is it cool? Is it cool? Is it cool? Are we cool? We are cool. <laughs> I like to love this house. See, like two episodes in, like I don't know how, how much time we spent, but it is looking pretty, pretty smexy to be honest. And for those who said I didn't place enough bushes, just wait and see. We're gonna place billions of bushes here. Not billions, but we're gonna place a lot, right? A lot, a lot. I was thinking, maybe we could extend this pond here, make like a little water feature here, and place a bunch of trees all around. What do you guys think? Yes, yes, no, yes. Yes, no. For all those who thought there was not enough bushes, I'm placing bushes. And don't, do not be alarmed. It's it's not done yet. Although, I'm just thinking, should we have like a bit more space here to walk on? Like at least two blocks here. Going to here somewhere. I don't know. Yes. Oops. See, guys? I'm gonna place some glowstone off camera underneath those. And um, we got some bushes here. That looks pretty smexy. 
don't don't worry like just let me build this off camera I add a bit more bushes i'm gonna resume i'm gonna show the house in a default texture pack and as well with the shader mods just so you guys know guys know how it looks like you know what this here i'm gonna take out a wall going this way it's gonna twist around here maybe and you may ask why are you doing this it's gonna be a little path here this is going to twist this way and what i'm going to do here is actually make this pawn which is here on this side i'm going to extend that all the way here just to make it pretty you know because you kind of need that a bit of prettiness in the life i can cover that this up now i don't need that oops do we see this from this side oh no what an ugly stuff going on here what an ugly stuff you don't even say that right no you don't bam so guys you know what since tree placement and like stuff like that is so boring to watch i'm gonna do that off camera so i'm gonna resume as soon as that is done and uh, yeah the house in the default texture pack and stuff so see you in like uno minuta but we got a little bush wall we got the exterior looking pretty smexy i would say see how simple it is just add some bushes, problem solved, problem evaded. Just like that. So guys, see you in a little, little, little bit. Alright? Alright. Holy mother of bushes. You know, I might have overdone it with the bushes, but I placed tons of them. Just look at this, guys. The shader mod and the bushes looks amazing and i know some people might rage that i did this off camera but i'm not gonna show you how to place down a sapling and bone mill it because that is just boring and this pond here just, oh what's that oh a squiddy i was like oh my god what's that just look at this we got a little waterfall over here a little cave here going all the way across as i said i'm gonna extend the pond right so i did that and snap it looks bananas inspiration 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 what i did off camera which i didn't show i placed this bush here because we had a gap you know i thought like let's fill that with a bush and as well i extended this path here the white thing here all the way around to that little corner that's the only thing i did right maybe oh yeah i did something else on the inside i tweaked back the stairs because i liked them this way better i guess <laughs> what's the dog is looking at buddies yo look at this on the inside just look at the exterior here oh my god and yeah guys you know it's like bushes it's all in the bushes trust me i placed some torches here on the outside i'm not sure the item frames look that good on the outside but i mean come on give me some credit for that at least <laughs> we got tons of bushes and this house is really simple trust me like and then just go crazy with some water features some uh, random tree placement and it's gonna be a win and like i'm, I'm no i know it's gonna be like oh my god what did you show this on camera but showing this on camera is so pointless because it's so random i just click bunch spam click everywhere just to place blocks and it's you know you can't follow that you can't do that it's just, it's just too hard to do but place those trees and bone mill them because it looks bananas also default texture pack that's right let me just fly down here are you ready for the default texture pack it's gonna look oh my god i don't want to even see this default texture pack Ooh, it's not that bad considering we're using the shader mod though but <laughs> i'm gonna turn that off in a second it doesn't look that bad to be honest we got the creeper faces that's kind of bad though you don't have to use the chiseled <laughs> chiseled <laughs> sandstone because that kind of fails in the default texture pack well, it's not that bad. I kind of like it anyways, you know? All right, so options, shaders, off. Ooh! I can't, I can't watch this. I can't watch this. But as you can see, tons of random bush placement. <laughs> Crazy. You know what, guys? You know what? It is time to end this. I'm happy with this house. You know, it's simple, yet kind of cool. Options, shaders, off, on, bam and you know give it a comment like favorite whatnot hopefully you guys enjoyed and no it's not gonna be a world safe download for this but just embrace the epicness of bushes i might have ever done that to be honest but i don't know <laughs> you know me and bushes kind of win-win 
is a small desert house. We can call it a small beach house as well, just in case we want to. It's a win-win nevertheless. <laughs> See you guys in the next one. Take care. Diamonds and love and all that things, you know. Where's my doggies at? Yo, buddies. <laughs> I kind of like this. I'm going to build this on my own little... Maybe feed the beast. Yes, we're going to do this on the feed the beast. Maybe. I don't know. We're going to see. See you guys. Bye-bye.